As we thaw out from this Arctic blast, many of you are dealing with frozen and now burst water pipes. Ceilings caved in, water dripping down walls, and plumbers booked solid. Kristen Volk is live on five at one Cleveland house dealing with broken pipes and a lot of damage. Kristen? Two pipes burst in this bathroom, and here are what the breaks look like. You can see these slits right here. It's the result of water freezing inside the pipe, then expanding enough to burst the copper open. And it's this kind of problem that's making plumbers work overtime. It's Bill Friedson's fourth service call of the day for broken water pipes. And this plumber has at least five more broken pipe jobs today and counting. We're pretty busy. I, I know. Uh, Diane in our office has a list of good 10 to 15 people waiting for us to get there. Hi, this is Diane with A1 Affordable Plumbing. Diane Weatherwax says business at A1 Affordable Plumbing in Cleveland hasn't been this busy in the past 15 years. I'm booking in next week. It's so busy that she had to start putting clients on a wait list. I had a towel here and it kept the water from going out that way, but it, the whole floor was wet. One of those clients is Carol Reese. Reese woke up to a flooded bathroom yesterday morning and called around for a plumber right away. They said they couldn't get to it right away, so we called another one, and they couldn't get to it, but both of them took our number. A day and a half later, A1 Affordable Plumbing finally fit her in their schedule. This is pretty common. Friedson expects to work overtime for the rest of this week and even Saturday to fix people's pipe problems. <laughs> To avoid any broken pipes in the future, the plumbing company recommends that you turn your faucet on in the extreme cold to just a trickle like that to keep water running through your faucets to avoid that water freezing inside the pipes. Live on 5 in Cleveland, I'm Kristen Volk.